are you receiving me? Am I on? I think I'm on. Hello guys! Welcome back to another video. This is a weird one. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, this is a weird one. This was originally for myself. It's a mystery box. Not just any mystery box though, you can probably guess by the name of the shop. Gloom and Gore. It's not exactly a uh, uh, cutesy things, let's just say that. Um, <laughs> but it's a, it's a mystery, uh, mystery box. It's a mystery box. And it was for myself. But then I thought, hang on a minute. Uh, content, in it. I can make some content out of this. See what happens. Because I don't actually know what's, um, what's in here. And it can go one of two ways. I'll either be really happy about it or it's gonna make me completely rethink my entire life choices. It can go either way. Right, I'll try and tell you what this is actually, because I've been I've been looking into <laughs> I've been going down a rabbit hole recently. Um, of cabinets of curiosities. Curiosities and oddities, to be exact. And I just couldn't help myself, okay? I just couldn't help myself. I wanted more. I wanted to get my hands on some oddities and curiosities and maybe make a little shelf or cabinet of my own. And I kind of like weird things. I'm a weird person. So why not? And then I thought, mystery box, even better, because I don't know what I'm going to get. And this will be fun. <laughs> But I'm no stranger. I'm no stranger to the the world of oddities. I'll show you something actually before we dive in. Hopefully my mic will pick me up as we go. I've got my special mini mic on now. I'm all fancy. But yeah, I'm no stranger to oddities. I've actually got some myself anyway. I think I can blame this guy on on my new obsession. Um it's a Rhodia skull. Here he is. He's magnificent. Now I have a thing for stags and deers. As you, if you saw my Book of Shadows video, stags is just like, I love stags. I love stag horns in particular. And I found this guy in an antique store in the wonderful seaside town of Whitby and I just fell in love instantly and now I love him I just love him and then I turned him over when I got home and I realised that they'd, they'd only gone and put a jawbone inside it as well not gonna lie I freaked out when I first when I first saw that I freaked out and I was like uh oh I'm now haunted but no, it's fine. It's actually the deer's jaw, so it's fine. And if you can see the actual date on it, 57. This is old. This is very old. But yeah, this is what started the obsession. This, this, this guy. I love him. Now, because it's from an antique sh store, I don't know whether it's ethnically sourced or not. I'm going to hope it is. I always try and make sure anything like this, taxidermy, anything like that, is ethnically sourced or found in the wild somewhere. So yeah, he's my he's my prized possession at the moment. I love him. I even pat him on the head when I go to bed and say goodnight. That's how much I love him. And then what else have I got that's odd <laughs> apart from myself? Yeah, I've got deer antlers got a lot of deer antlers and skulls well I say a lot it's just a handful another skull I have this one was actually found just in the wild around my home a bird skull we think it's a raven or a crow not quite sure but I've got this this one's my biggest bird skull and then I have two more little ones and they were just found out in the wild, just outside my home, so... I was just like, sure, I'm having him, I'm keeping him. And then, deer antler. It kind of had its, like, the, the best bits chopped off. Uh, but I didn't mind. 
I was happy with this anyway. It actually makes for quite a nice like wand. If you hold it like that, it kind of works like a wand. And it just, it feels good. It's just like, rrr, proper like stag power that is. So yeah, I'm no, I'm no, I'm not squeamish when it comes to things like skulls or taxidermy or anything like that. But the thing is, I don't actually know for sure what's in this box. I wanted to keep it as much as a surprise as possible. So, um, yeah, like I said, this could go one of two ways. Let's find out, shall we? <laughs> I don't know why I'm nervous. I'm nervous in case, what if there's a bug in there? Oh my God. If there's a bug in here, I'm going to scream. Let me get a drink. If there's something like an insect in here, I might just freak out and scream. <laughs> Let's hope not. Let's hope not. Right. Lovely store, by the way. Lovely store owner. I asked permission to film this video. So, thank you very much for letting me actually film this video. How do I get into you? Do I even want to get in? I don't know. Right, let's do this. Ooh, it's happening. Oh God, okay. Is, is everything gonna be wrapped up individually or is it gonna all just be there, like one big jump scare? Okay. Let's see what we've got, shall we? I wonder if things are labeled, otherwise I won't even know what I'm looking at. Oh, it is individually wrapped. Oh dear. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh, it's like Christmas. It's like Christmas, but for weird people. Right. Oh, where do I start? What do I look at? What's this? The smallest envelope ever. Okay, let's just start right here then. Let's hope nothing got broken in transit. What? Domestic? Dem what? I'm sorry, what? D can you read that as well? Domestic bunny fur. Domestic bunny fur? Okay, we're starting out strong. I did not expect that, okay. What, you mean actual... Okay, right. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? You did... Uh, I, oh, God. What if I... I don't want to damage. I don't want to damage it. Let me, like... Let me go in, like, this way. <gasps> I'm going to regret this, aren't I? I'm going to re regret this. What? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh gosh. Well, I've got my mini mic on, so if I like leg it to the other side of my bedroom, it's fine because you can still hear me. You can still hear me freak out. Okay, domestic. What? What is that? What am I looking at? Well, I know what I'm looking at, but what am I looking at at the same time? What? What? I'm sorry, what? What, what, what? What the? Is this okay to touch? Can I touch this? Do I need gloves? That is literally, it's literally fur. It is literally a slab of bunny rabbit fur and skin. Ugh. Why do I do this to myself? Why do I do this to myself? I did skim the, the, the bits of like reviews and stuff and I'm pretty sure I didn't see anything about fur in, in the description. <laughs> okay, 
starting off strong, we've got a piece of rabbit. A domesticated rabbit. What does that mean if it's domesticated? I'm hoping it just means it got old and it died and now I just have it. Okay. I mean, I mean, it's fluffy. It's fluffy. <laughs> it's, it's, it's fluffy. It's, it's fine. It's, it's fluff. It's fluff. It's just fluff. It's fine. It's fine. Put it to the side. It's fine. I can use it as a, I don't know what I can use that as. I can use that as a, I can put something on it or something. Okay, moving on. Okay, um, like this is a weird start. All right, next. Okay, what do we, nope. <laughs> okay, hang on. If I just got, have I got the rabbit box? Is this what this is? Just like a rabbit. Okay, a wild rabbit foot. I mean, hang on a minute, aren't rabbit foots meant to be really, really lucky? Or is it the opposite? Is it luck or bad luck? I think it's lucky to have a rabbit foot. Oh my god, it's a rabbit foot. I thought, I thought that was, I thought that was bad enough. Okay, okay, going in, going in going in oh going in okay now um I sh i've probably put a disclaimer up on this before i even started you know editing sweet pea do your job okay editing sweet pea you know what to do there'll have been a disclaimer before all this but everything is ethnically sourced okay just before people come at me and say oi it, everything's been ethnically sourced. I made sure of it. That's why I bought from this shop because it was very clear. And taxidermy is what they're into as a little side hobby. So I was like, this will be really interesting. And so far it is very interesting. And oh my God, I'm touching it. Ah, 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 ah. It's got claws. It's got claws. I didn't know bunny rabbits had claws. Of course they have claws, what am I on about? Of course they do, oh my god. Okay, right. That's a straight up rabbit's foot, okay. Oh, oh, it's little paws. It's little pauses. Oh my god, it's little paws. And it's little claws are still intact. How the, oh gosh. I don't think my camera light focuses on stuff, but that's a straight up rabbit foot. That's something that I didn't own before and now I do. Um, you know what? I actually really like it. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. I actually really quite like that because rabbit foots are meant to be quite symbolic. And I think a bit spiritual as well. I don't know much about it, but I definitely know rabbit foot is something. Ah, uh, yeah. Rabbit fur, rabbit foot. You know what I said earlier about not being screamish? Um, I take that back. I take all of that back. It turns out I actually am more screamish than I thought. Oh, there's more in here than I thought. I bought the smallest box. Uh, uh, now, now I'm really worried. The fact that I've already got a foot, now I'm really worried. If this, oh God, if there's something in here that's an insect, if this is a bug, I am going to literally scream. Uh, uh, what am I looking at? What am I looking at? Oh, thank God. It's rose quartz. It's quartz. No, it's quartz. It's crystal. It's a crystal. Oh, it's a crystal. I can breathe. It's fine. It's a crystal. Oh, I'm happy again. I'm happy. I'm happy again. I've got quartz. My life is fine again. It's good. <laughs> it's good. It's all good. 
it's all good now I've got cloudy quartz look at that another thing to add to my massive crystal collection I'm sorry if I keep going out of frame I'm just freaking out a bit cloudy quartz I thought it was a bone when I was opening it because it's like it like it looks like a bone but it's cloudy quartz apparently I don't own cloudy quartz so thanks for that I love a good crystal why do I feel like I should stand up for all of this just in case Ugh, where do I go let's do a small one again small equals happy good things let's try that happy 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 good things okay right let's try this I don't want to damage anything inside I'm like really nervous to like not only open them but also to damage <laughs> why am I freaking out so much just in case it's a bug I'm going to flip if it's a bug oh, please don't be ah what the fuck was oh my what the that ain't real that ain't of course it's not real don't be daft it's a it's a <laughs> hmm It's a, um, it's a fake finger nail, fake finger thing. It's got a little chain on it, uh, it's got a little chain on it, so you can wear it as a necklace. Um, that looks disturbingly real though. I literally did have a teeny weeny jump scare when I open that because that looks so real what oh that looks too real that looks that's just that's too real that's just too realistic oh my gosh what I think the owner of this shop, again, I just skimmed the details. I didn't really read it properly because I wanted to surprise myself. Probably not the best idea. They are also, they make sculptures and things. They actually make stuff. I mean, if this is just a taste of what they make, this is talent. This is talented because this looks real. This legit looks real. Um, okay, I will, I will put that somewhere, um, I don't know where, but I'll put it somewhere. Okay, now we're on to bigger, bigger things. Wrapped up bigger things, okay, I need to sit down. Sit my butt down, just sit down. You don't need to be stood up, it's fine. They're not going to attack you, it's fine. <laughs> okay, this is wrapped in bubble wrap, which makes me a bit more scared, not gonna lie. Okay, what do we got? And how do I get in without breaking you, whatever you are? Handy scissors. There we go. In we go. It's a jar of what? It's a jar of what though? That's the question, is it? What is it? What is it? What the? What is it? Hedgehog quills? <gasps> Hedgehog! Hedgehog quills! That is actually super cool. Hedgehog quills? No way! The little quills of a hedgehog! No! Look! I know that won't, you won't be able to see it very well on camera, but they actually look so cool. That's, oh, oh, I'm loving this. Oh, I like that. And in the jar too, that is so cool. The rabbit foot and the quills, they're my favourite so far. 
Oh, that really is a curiosity and an oddity. And there's more. <laughs> okay, this is the biggest one. I can see bones already. I can see, but I can see bones. I can see bones in the bottom. I can see bones already. Oh boy. I just showed everybody a giant skull that I own already. Why why are bones made on on a oh, okay, right. Continue. Continue. Oh we'll be here all day. There's way more than I thought in here. I thought I'd only get two or three items. Okay, oh I don't want it. What if it's another finger? What if it's another finger? Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Uh -huh. It's in bubble wrap again. It's in a jar again. Wrapping paper, get out the way. Oh, what is it? What is it? Please don't be an insect. Oh, what is that? What are you? What in the world? It's not labelled. But it's bones. It's some sort of bones in a jar but it's also got like moss it's also got like moss in it it's like a little oh what are they called T terrariums that's not the word is it no is it? yeah but it's like it's it's little bones i don't know what kind of bone i'll put it over here because it's better to see over here yeah, it's two of these long bones and then it's got like some sort of moss at the bottom. And that's actually really cool. That is so cool actually. I love these jars. These little jars. Look at that. That is so cool. They're gonna look so cool. Just like sat somewhere. Like my own little, my own little weird corner of curiosities on my altar space. Now it doesn't actually have a label so I don't know what type of bone or creature it's from but I don't I don't mind. I don't mind that I don't know. That's just really cool. Oh my lord. It just keeps going. Okay. Diving in again. This one here, another big one. Yeah, let's see what do we got. Open this one. Another bubble wrapped one. Get rid of the wrapping paper. I'm gonna have to get in with scissors again, aren't I? Uh, nothing's broken so far, so that's good news. I mean, they are from the UK, and I'm in the UK anyway, so. At least it's not had to go far, which is good. Right, let's see. What do we got? What? Oh, it's a thimble. It's a little wee thimble. It's a little wee thimble. Ah, that's cute. It's a bone china, fine bone china. And it's got a little bear on it. It's one of those thimble things. Like the, the, it's like you put it on your thumb, don't you? And for like sewing and stuff. At least I think that's what they are. Ah! All of a sudden, this is a wholesome video. Such a wholesome video with just a cute little thimble. That's really cute <laughs> and very random. They weren't lying when they said random stuff. Okay, I'm leaving the bones for now because they look a bit... They look very interesting. I want to leave them till last. Okay, going in again. Please don't be a bug. Please don't be a bug. If it is... I'm going to die. Okay, what does it say? Fox tooth? 
Foxtooth. It's a tooth of a fox. It wasn't lying. Oh. Oh, wow. Uh oh. Oh. Can I... Can I make it zoom, zoomy, zoom, zoom? Look at that. That is a fox tooth. That is, that's interesting. What? Whoa. I like that. I do like that, I must say. I've got nothing fox related on my altar or anything. Foxes are cool. <laughs> I like foxes. Okay, right, what have we got left? Let me just dig in. What is this? <laughs> what is this? <laughs> what is that? There's the, oh god, there's stuff like hidden in this. It's like a nest of weird stuff. Ah, okay. Oh, I just seen something weird. It's all weird. What am I talking about? Oh, oh my. What the actual? What is that? What? Is, what is this? It's an eye. It's a random eye. And it's just an eye, it's not, it's just an eye. <laughs> it's just an eyeball. It's just an eyeball. Oh, it's, it's an eyeball to go with his friend, the fingernail. Um, <laughs> okay. I'm going to put those two to the side. <laughs> those freak me out. Oh, those freak me out. They're too realistic. Okay, I'm digging in, I'm digging in. I'm like a vulture and I'm like digging in. Oh, we've got a feather. Is it a pheasant feather? It's a hen. Hen pheasant. Hen pheasant feather. Yeah, I love pheasants. And I love feathers. And I have hens. Perfect. Great to add to my collection of feathers. Just like I said in my Book of Shadows tour video, I have a huge collection of feathers. I love feathers. <laughs> we, 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 we keep going from really, really freaky to really, really cute. It just keeps going back and forth into like, yay, and then what the? Ah. It's cool. Right, let's see. I don't want to damage anything. What's that? What is that? It's like a stamp. It's like a really old looking stamp. Oh, that's a weird coincidence. I was literally just looking through a collection of really old stamps today. And keeping some that I liked and then getting rid of some that I don't like because I have huge collection. Another one to the collection. Okay, going in again. Right, there's some sort of... What? I'm digging in. I'm digging in deep. There's a shoe. There's a... A shoe? A doll? The... <clears throat> There's a doll's. <laughs> There's a doll's shoe with moss and a bone inside of it. Um, let me run that by you one more time. There's a doll's shoe with a bone stuck inside of it. It says what bone it is. What is it? Misk. Well, that doesn't help, does it? <laughs> you don't just put misk. You have to tell me what kind of bone it is. Is that supposed to look like a leg bone? It is, isn't it? I've just realised. That's supposed to look like a foot with a leg bone stuck out of it. It's weird. And it's wonderful. I love it. Thank you. 
thank you. I, I actually really like that. I like all of it. All of it so far has been great. I think there's one thing left. Saved it till last. Oh, is that a pentacle? Is that a pentacle I see before me? It is. <gasps> oh! Thank you, I love it. I love it. How did you know I was a witch? <laughs> How did you know I like pentacles? Oh, look at that. Okay, that's the best one out of everything. That is the best one. What have we got? Rab rabbit. It's rabbit again. I have been... I need to look up rabbits and the, the spiritual meanings of rabbits. Because this has been... A rabbit box. <laughs> if ever I've seen one, this is a rabbit box, definitely. So I think rabbits are trying to call out to me today and say, Oi, the rabbit spirit wants to talk to me today. So we've got a cute little charm, and then we've got rabbit bones in the shape of like a cross. That's awesome. Now that's cool, that's something I would probably buy if I saw. <laughs> okay, okay. What a collection! I think that's it, unless there's any randoms stuffed in here. I don't think so. We're good. We've done it. Oh my god, I love everything. Aha! There you are. Gloom and gore, art and oddities. You you came through with the oddity part and you came through with the art part. And I'm assuming that's a barcode to go to the Esty shop. So I can obviously let people scan that to go to your shop. I highly recommend it. If you're into stuff like this, go right ahead. Totally worth it. I wasn't expecting half of these things. And I'll leave a link in the description to go to their SD. Ah, that's so cool. That is so cool. So weird so cool okay let's do a little quick review of everything 10 out of 10 love it that's gonna go somewhere nice <laughs> creepy af creepy af don't know what i'm gonna do with them but i do like them because they're creepy and because they're made handmade by this person so very talented but super creepy love them a thimble very random in this box and then a cute little old stamp this has kind of got cottage core vibes I really like that. That'll probably stick into my Book of Shadows somewhere. And then this will go somewhere nice too. I really like that. Then we've got some cloudy quartz. So that's good to add to my collection of crystals. I like how it's witchy as well, this box. It's kind of got a weird, not just oddities, it's also got a bit of a witchy vibe going on. A fox's tooth. I think that's so cool. I just, there's something about bones and I, uh, like I said before, I blame that skull that I bought. A hundred percent blame that roe deer skull that I got for my new obsession with bones. So that'll definitely go somewhere lovely. You can never say no to a feather. Just get me any feather, just a random feather off the ground, I'll take it, I'll have it. That's going to go somewhere special because I have a special collection 
of all kinds of unique feathers and now I have this one I love it then we have <laughs> this creepy creepy doll foot complete with a random bone inside of it and I actually weirdly love this I actually love this I think it's so biz it's it's one of those things where it's so bizarre that I just love it that's definitely gonna go out somewhere on the altar just sitting in the corner or something and people are gonna look and be like hang on a minute what is that and then I have to explain to everybody that it's not haunted and it's not cursed well, I mean it might be it, it might be, but I'm, I'm sure it's fine. It's fine. I'll be fine. None of this stuff is going <laughs> to... I'm fine. I'm fine. Ah, oh, these. I am in love. I'm in love with these. It's the jars that make it. It really is. <laughs> it's the little jars. The hedgehog. Hedgehog thingies. The little hedgehog like quill things that is really cool there's just something about those that i really like and then this as well just the presentation of it with the moss they are awesome they're my favorite things i think that's my favorite absolute favorite and then i think these two come in close second that's probably third all of this is cool. And then we've got... Uh, we've got rabbit fur and skin. And a lovely rabbit foot to go with it. <laughs> this is... Uh, it's so weird to touch this rabbit foot. I don't know why. It's just so weird. A rabbit foot. Again, I love it though. Just because it's weird, I love it. Purely because it's weird. I just find it fascinating. Oh, just so cool and weird. But this is the weirdest. Just to have literally a piece of rabbit skin and fur. That is the, that's the creepiest one. Is that the first one I opened as well? Of course I had to open the creepiest one first. Uh, 10 out of 10 would buy again. Um, probably won't be able to though when my uh, when my mum and stepdad see this. They're gonna be like, hang on a minute. <laughs> They're gonna be like, you, 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 okay sure you're a witch and that's fine we love you anyway. Uh, but now you're taking it a bit too far. <laughs> but, oh, this is great. This is such a good collection. Like, just this alone is great. Because this will be, like, just such a cool oddity collection that I now have. Ah. Well, that was fun. That was exciting. It was kind of scary at times and then wholesome in other times and then an all-round great success, I think. <laughs> what a random video. So random. But I just thought I had to film it just, you know, just for the fun of it. Just to get my, my, my real first reaction to these things. And I had no idea what to expect. I knew that there was a possibility of bones. That's why I showed you my my skull at the start. So so bones I'm not that bad with, but it's like this. <laughs> they freaked me out. <laughs> and then also um, the two little figure figure thingies. That that finger that jump scared me. I don't know if it showed on camera, but I I did jump when I saw the tip of that finger I thought I'd been trolled hard by a serial killer anyway thank you 
for joining me on this little adventure. It was a very random video, a very weird video. I don't think any more videos I make are going to be this weird. I think this is I think this is it. <laughs> My next video I'm planning for witchy stuff is probably an altar tour next. I think I can only progress upwards from Book of Shadows to altar tour perhaps. Soon TM maybe. Anyway, how do I even end this video? How long has it been? 40 minutes. Yep, I should end this video. <sighs> Thank you for watching and I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye now.